well, crap, you go to install your car seat in your car and you realize that your headrests are in the way and they're non-removable. Let me show you where your options are. For vehicles with non-removable headrests, especially those that tilt forward quite a bit, they can interfere with some forward-facing harnessed car seats and a lot of high back boosters. Let me show you some examples. Some forward-facing harnessed car seats do not want the vehicle headrest pushing on the car seat's headrest like this one does. To be honest, some manuals state this very clearly as something they want you to look out for and others don't. So if you get to installing your seat and you notice this happening with your vehicle with non-removable headrests, just contact the manufacturer and they're gonna tell you what's allowed and what's not. So before you write the seat off as being completely incompatible, I want you to assess if there's multiple recline positions in forward facing mode and play with those a little bit. So let's adjust this recline. And look at that, it magically fixed it. I haven't installed the seat, but even when I do, now the headrest of the car seat is not in any way being pushed forward by the vehicle seat. So just double check those reclines and you know, for whatever options you are allowed to use, you may need to change them up to get it to be compatible with your vehicle headrest. There are some car seats that are just known to work well with non-removable headrests, especially those that have a severe tilt forward. For example, this one, no matter what recline position I move the seat into, it doesn't create any gapping here between the headrest and the back of the car seat. These two are allowed to touch. It's just not allowed to, I can't even fake make it happen because it works well for this seat. So head to our car seat buying kits if you want help choosing the very best car seat for you for all occasions, but it also takes into consideration seats that work really well with non-removable headrests. Non-removable headrests tend to create more of an issue in high back boosters because many of our high back boosters require that the seat, the uh, booster itself is flush with the vehicle seat. So you can see here that this is not a compatible high back booster because of this tilted forward headrest. It creates a gap here in the back of the seat. Let me show you one that works better. The difference with this high back booster is it allows you to have a bit of a gap between the back of the high back booster and the vehicle headrest. So what's a girl to do? If you already have your car seat, your forward facing harness car seat or your high back booster and it's not compatible, you're gonna check the reclines. If there are multiple recline options, test one of those like we did with the Bretex Grow With You seat. You could also look at moving your seat into a different vehicle seating position. Oftentimes the headrests in the second row are different than those in the third row. If you have a you know, three row vehicle, so you could take a look at that. The third option, if your child is already in high back booster mode and you really feel like they are mature enough, ready enough to transition to no back booster, if your high back booster converts to a no back booster, you could do that or you could invest in a no back booster and just move them into that stage so you don't have to deal with the headrest issue at all. If you are in the process of purchasing and you have a vehicle that has these non-removable tilted forward headrests, how are you gonna know which ones are gonna work? Okay, well, let me tell you, it is a pain in the butoski because here's what you would have to do. You're gonna literally have to narrow down which options are the seats that you wanna take a look at. You're going to have to go online and read every single manual cover to cover. If that does not sound like a jolly good time to you, then just go ahead and invest in the forward facing booster buying kit where we have done all that work for you and list there very clearly which seats will work in vehicles with non-removable tilted forward headrests.